From WNY News, this is First Morning Weather. Well, welcome back. It was a warm day today across the Twin Tiers with temperatures in the 80s. The humidity, though, in check, but that will be on the rise as we head through the next 24 hours. Wellsboro Sky Cam showing some cloudy conditions, now giving way to some breaks in the overcast as we're tracking some clearing here uh, just off to our west. So we have a weak boundary coming through right now. Cloudy skies, maybe a sprinkle here or there, but you can see some clearing skies uh, just to the west of Elmira. So we'll likely see a little bit of sunshine prior to sunset this evening. Tracking a frontal boundary back to the west towards Chicago, and you can see these showers and thunderstorms developing here over northern sections of Illinois. And the reason I'm pointing this out is because this is part of the system that'll be affecting our region for tomorrow. Again, in the short term, not too much happening locally. We do have some clouds in place, but clearing uh, off to the west, especially near Bath and Canastillo and Hornell, Dansville, enjoying some sunshine right now. And again, that clearing line will push eastbound over the next hour or so. 80 in Elmira, 78 Watkins Glen, 79 the current temperature in Mansfield. Tomorrow's planner showing hazy sunshine through the morning and then later in the afternoon, increasing chances for some showers and thunderstorms. And some of those thunderstorms could be on the strong side, but not too much going on. If you have any outdoor plans through the first half of the day tomorrow, should be good to go. By 3 o'clock in the afternoon, though, you can see some pop-up showers and thunderstorms developing, still mainly to the west of Elmira. This will tend to fill in, though. By 5 p.m., you can see clusters of showers and thunderstorms becoming more likely. There will be pockets of heavy rain and perhaps some gusty winds with those thunderstorms. Into the evening, looks like our thunderstorm threat will taper some, but there will be some leftover showers here through about midnight or so, and then beyond that, a drying trend uh, for our Thursday. Now, as far as rainfall amounts go, well, not too much through about 3 o'clock in the afternoon, but look at this computer model, especially targeting the northern tier of Pennsylvania. This is a better chance where we have some thunderstorms, and in those thunderstorms, there could be pockets of heavy rain. Farther north you go, it looks like the rain will be a bit lighter in intensity, but still could be looking at about a quarter to a third of an inch of rain in and around the Elmira area. Now, as far as the severe weather threat goes, bit of a bullseye to our south. We're looking at a one out of five on the severe weather scale. So a bit humid here until that cold front comes through tomorrow and then refreshingly less humid here for Thursday and Friday. Uh, so better weather moves in once the front passes through tomorrow evening. Today we forecast 89, 84 the unofficial high at the Elmira Corning Regional Airport. 67 for a low tonight, tomorrow up to 86. Best chance for thunderstorms later in the afternoon. Thursday and Friday looking nice. A separate system could bring a few more showers and thunderstorms Saturday, some of which may linger into the second half of the weekend on Sunday.